my best go for no stories when I just uh, got into the career sales. My sister-in-law had given me a book called The Greatest Salesman in the World. Actually, the book found me. And it gave me hope. It inspired me that I could do more and be more with my life. So I thought that, hey, those who were involved in sales uh, did really well. And she helped me get a job at Cellular One selling cellular phones. So the day I went to go for my first day of the job, the general manager, I still remember his name, Jim Beckett, said, you know, I'm sorry, Burke, but uh, we cannot hire you because uh, we have a policy at our company that we just don't hire family members. Now, keep in mind, I had quit my other job. I mean, I was all in, and I was so excited about starting in this new sales career. Remember, my major was criminal justice, so I don't have any sales background, so this is my first, uh, uh, first experience with sales, and I was really looking forward to it. So he says, hey, Burke, I'm sorry we can't hire you. And uh, I was so disappointed. I was so rejected. I went home, didn't know what to do. This was Monday. And what I said was, hmm, I'm not going to take no for an answer. So the next morning, I got up at 5. I was at the office at 5.30 in the morning because I heard Mr. Beckett like to get there early in the morning. So I was there before he showed up, and I said to him, you have to hire me. In fact, I asked to speak to him, and I gave him all the compelling reasons why no was not good enough and that why he needed to hire me and what I could do for, for the company. And he finally, reluctantly agreed to hire me, but I could only uh, work and sell in a territory that was uh, uh, Pasco County. They called it where all the cows were. So he thought, surely I was destined to fail, and I wouldn't want to be involved in sales because nobody succeeds in Pasco County. And sure enough, I said, I'll take the job. I'll take it. And yes, I did. I got in my car, and I drove an hour just to cross to the Pasco County line where I started my sales career. And let me tell you, because I didn't take no as an answer, not only did I beat everyone uh, as the salesman of the month, the very first month, I outsold everybody in the office combined. In six months, I was the number one salesperson for Cellular One all-time record just because I refused to take no as an answer.